Hello all, welcome to TJ Podcast which presents Unveiling India's Milestone in Railways. I am your host, Tavish Jerry. Today we are going to talk about the India's Milestone in Railways. So as we all know very well that India has a big railway system and it stands as the world's fourth largest national railway system with a, a track kilometer of 1,4647 and a route kilometer of 68,426 with a whopping 1.2 million employees and world's ninth largest employer and India's second largest employer. And it runs, uh, it operates trains of 13,523 daily and with the stations of 7,325 and we will be knowing a lot of uh, information like this and let us move on to our broadcast. Introduction. What do we have as the introduction is that the history uh, when does it started and when how was the railways in, at the past and at the present they used steam engines steel tracks and everything as their uh, past system compared to now and do you know when was the IRCT's website was uh, created to answer all the questions we'll be going into this so the indian railways has a rich history that date back to 1853 when the first passenger train was introduced between bombay now mumbai and thane station it also played a crucial role in connecting different regions of india and promoting economic growth and in the early 1800s the british introduced the first uh, railway line in madras with steel tracks from red hills to chinhadere pet station it also has some passenger railways and to the uh, goods track in 1837 it became official in 1853 the india launch uh, the british launched the india's first passenger train journey officially from bori bandar to thane and it also had a lot of train types steam engine train types like the sahib the sind and the sultan which was a grand railways which can ha- uh, have 400 passengers with uh, 34 kilometers and consists of 14 carriages in that train at that time it was all it was the one day bharat which we call it and the first indian bridge from Bo- was built on bor ghat in maharashtra and the uh, which connecting bombay and pune with 200 feet in elevation so it is a lifeline for millions of people providing affordable and accessible transportation across the country it also played a developing role the first was the ER-223, also known as the Fairy Wheel, with a simple and a sleek design with 40 kilometers per hour. It started from it started its first journey from Howrah to Hooghly in 1854. In the 1880s, the Darjeeling Himalayan Railway with the World Heritage Site. So this railway was a significant in tourism. In 1897, the Jodhpur Railway introduced the electrical lighting in railway coaches with 
passengers and both goods it also the karka simla railway operating in 1903 gained the world heritage status in 2008 like the darjeeling himalayan railways but also in 1924 the uh, india presented its first railway budget in the parliament in 1924 the launch of the first electric train uh, began and in and also it also gained a lot of momentum in 1950 the first locomotive manufacturing unit in chittadran and in 1955 the first coach manufacturing unit in madras began and also we are going to see in the railways of british so the railways had a lot of things and but in as because of india only we gained a lot of new technologies in railway railways after the independence like in the 1956 they are uh, gave the first air conditioned railway from howrah to new delhi and the next one is the development of uh, indian railways like the electrification we uh while high speed rail and other things like the vande bharat which had uh, from the varanasi to delhi to mumbai to ahmedabad and the next slide is the key milestones in indian railways india railways contributes significantly to the country's gdp and it provides employment opportunity millions of people it provides the uh, faculties and transportation goods and raw materials supporting various industries transportation like the indian railways is also the lifeline of the country's transportation system it connects remote areas provides affordable and accessible travel op- options for millions of people indian railways has played a pivotal role of connecting different regions of the country it has contributed to the cultural and exchange and integration of diverse communities impact of indian railways like the upcoming projects like the underground metro which has been opened in kolkata recently and the high speed train uh, has been a dedicated freight carriers and the development in indian railways like the introduction of wifi service the ircts introduced in 1919 and became an official website in february 2002 we use like uh, and the technologicals also like the artificial intelligence which use its automatic braking system automatic doors in the new vande bharat trains and it ca- it inf- improves the efficiency safety convenience for the passengers and the predictive maintenance also and the future of railway indian railways with several upcoming projects and advancement plan to enhance the country's railways infrastructure and thank you for watching this podcast and i am your host tavish jerry signing off thank you